Hello. Yeah. <laughs> ก็ครับคุณครับคุณครับนี่เลยไอ้ที่มีสิทธิ์ทําให้ทุกอย่างดีขึ้นอ่ะมันก็ยึดเสียงอ่ะคุณครับอยากให้ทุกอย่างเอ
Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. I, on behalf of the Government Sahar College, do welcome you all in this Zoom and YouTube live video conference. Let me have first an introduction to our special and renowned speakers from our college, uh, Professor Abdul Hanan Barbuya, principal. He holds uh, an MA Master of Arts in Economics and also MPhil and had also completed his LLB. He is a native of Assam state, very fluent in Brazil, and had previously worked in the Chongte College and in various colleges in Assam. We are very fortunate to have him as a father of an esteemed college. Let's, uh, me, let me introduce uh, Sir Tan Chiruma, who is also one of our uh, special speaker here. <coughs> he is an associate professor of the Paul Science Department and also the program officer in the NSS unit, Government Science College. He will be delivering a speech on NSS, its history and future programs. Uh, comes next is Sir uh, Mark. Dr. V. Valarema, Assistant Professor, Government Science College, is a renowned host and speaker in various programs and in outside the state. He will de deliver a speech on choice-based credit system. Then we have Sir R. Ram Tintana, who is also an associate assisti assistant professor and the head of department in sociology department, hardworking and a talented person. He is also a member of secretary at the examination department. He will deliver a speech on online mode of examination. Uh, each speaker uh, will have 15 minutes as uh, a time bound. And to begin with, uh, let me have a short prayer. Our Heavenly Father, we thank you for this opportunity to have this Zoom and YouTube video on online conferencing. We pray that you would be with us throughout this program. We also pray for our speakers who are about to deliver on special and various topics. We also pray that you would be each and every one of our members and also to our college students as well. Help us and guide us, guide us throughout this program. We pray all this in Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. Now I shall call upon to, uh, our principal to have a keynote address. Am I audible now? Yes, sir. Okay. So, thank you, Mr. Benjamin F. Nosha, uh, the host and the overall technical in charge of tonight's program. Present here are my dear colleagues who simultaneously are also the resource persons tonight, namely, uh, Pu Banal Plansuma associate professor and head department of political science and the senior most program officer of NSS government Sahih college and uh, Mr. Mark V. Vanlal Rema, assistant professor department of English who is a dynamic speaker and a knowledgeable and disciplined teacher and next is Mr. R. Ramthin Thanga assistant professor and head department of sociology who happens to be the chief architect of our whole examination process here in the college. And lastly, <clears throat> and most importantly, the galaxy of my young exuberant students of first semester class, whom I would prefer to call or address as the blooming birds in the garden of government say college. I have been asked to deliver the keynote address, 
but I am overwhelmingly happy tonight to find this rare platform to interact with especially the new students and just crossing the boundary, taking it an opportunity right from, you know, a type of welcoming you all down to, I'd like to go down to the level of a motivational speech rather. I hope you will understand maybe taking it as a principal's discretion. Now, dear students, uh, coming to the today's theme, you know, you have been admitted in such a time, such a critical time to the college that very, very unfortunately, you cannot have a direct interaction with your teachers. This is supposed to be the first and foremost thing in an institutional system. But anyway, you know, the most difficult thing to accept in this world is change. The most difficult thing. However, the success lies in accepting and adopting to the changing scenario every day. We know every morning is a new morning, every day is a new day with new problems and challenges and complain and despair are not the solutions, rather challenge and response, that's where the meaning of life is, that's where the success lies. So we all are supposed to meet the changed situation every day in an innovative way. You know, this is the this has become the order of the day. So we should not uh, give up. We should not leave it. Rather, we should face every challenge every day as per requirement. What I mean, I think you understand that offline classes you were not having, still you were having the opportunity, the alternative is offline mode, which has a lot of shortcomings, difficulties, especially in a place like Siha, uh, uh, where communication system is not up to the mark. But then uh, here, I'd like to reiterate the point that complain, despair, these are not the solutions. Rather, we have to make the most of what we have. Whatever we have, we have to make, we have to make the most, utmost use of it. You know, it's not very difficult uh, so far as our college is concerned, so far as your course is concerned, because yours is, um, you know, a humanity, you belong to humanity department uh, in literature and uh, social science. Here, things are not uh, much of uh, demanding the practical classes like as we need in science and technology. Uh, so I hope you can make out with the textbooks, with the reference books, and with the sustained guidance of the experienced teachers. Uh, feel free to interact with them on any critical issues. Okay, since we are time bound and we are having limited time. Next important thing I would like to uh, mention here on the important points uh, I am mentioning here is the very motto of education. You know, it is education. Education is a very vast concept. And it is the one of the two important aspects of changing human being into human resources. So, Education you should take very seriously. It's a very wide thing and it covers the curricular, especially two things I'd like to mention, the curricular as well as co-curricular aspects. So far as curricular aspects. Okay. So, so far as the curricular aspect is concerned, it is, you know, the text, it is, the content, it is the content of your course, which is being taught by the teachers and which you learn from the books. 
there is a regular system of examination, evaluation, mock sheet, certificate, and all that. This is the curricular aspect. But co-curricular aspect that is giving a practical touch is another important thing because you know theoretically you may be graduates, but practically tomorrow you will have to work in this world. And to have the uh, real touch of life, there are various co-curricular activities incorporated with the educational system. And one of these is the National Service Scheme, NSS, uh, wherein you learn how to interact with the society, how to contribute back to the community which you belong to. Because, you know, especially in India and more so in higher educational system, uh, you are being taught at the expense of the society at large because public cost of higher education is much more higher than the private cost. Means uh, uh, you were studying at the cost of the nation and the nation also expects a return from you. And various, in various capacities, you will have to serve the society back after your graduation so that you get this particular orientation NSS has been incorporated into the system. So in it, uh, Sarchunga, uh, being a very experienced person in his field, will be focusing on, I'm not going into, the, into that. And next uh, is our topic on CBCS, Choice-Based Credit System. This is also another new system uh, uh, replacing the old traditional system. He also a little bit of technical aspects you need to understand since you were here in this system for the first time up to your higher secondary level, there was no CBCS. So we have many things to uh, know about the system and you have wide choice. Theoretically speaking, you have wide choices so far as your content and course of study is concerned and more so uh, at the advent of new educational policy there is uh, expected to be much more options, much more choices, but practically there may be uh, limitations, uh, especially in the peripheral uh, part of the country, including Sihar district. So on it also elaborately, as I said, a uh, very renowned uh, speaker, very prolific speaker we have, uh, Sir Mark, so who will be throwing light on it. And lastly, I would like to say about the examination system for which also again, fortunately, we have a very, very dedicated whom I have said as the chief architect of our whole examination system in the college, uh, Mr. R. Ramtintanga, uh, who takes it as a, a very personal uh, matter, like uh, each and every student he attends to the with utmost care and diligence. And by now he has experienced a lot about the system. He will be talking about the uh, pros and cons, about the shortcomings, about various uh, technical aspects, I should say. And he'll be throwing light on it. But uh, here I would like to mention one thing, which I mentioned in the beginning, like uh, the most difficult thing to accept in this world is change. That is acceptance of change uh, necessarily means dynamicism, necessarily means a flexibility. Uh, you must be flexible to accept whatever comes about. However, however, there must be some reservations. You cannot compromise the basics. There are some basics which, with which you must be rigid. You cannot be flexible. These are la some social values, moral values, ethical values. And especially in this examination sister, uh, uh, aspect, this becomes important. Of course, you will accept the change, the changed system of examination. Earlier, it was like, uh, you know, uh, pen and paper examination within the hall under the supervision of invigilators. But now uh, it is online examination and uh, one can say open book examination. So here, if you compromise with the basic of sincerity of honesty, like uh, if you really open the book and copy down, 
you can do that, but then you are cheating yourself, remember. You should not compromise with the basics. The motto ultimately of education is to learn, is to train yourself. And the examination is to test yourself. So uh, if in the examination system, taking it as an open book exam, and if you compromise, uh, see with the basics of honesty, uh, you will fail to test yourself today and tomorrow you will fail in life. So I hope you will keep in mind these words like adopt with the changed situation, but not compromising with the basic ethical values. So uh, I think time is up. It's uh, exactly 15 minutes for now. So with this, uh, I'd like to wind up. I would like to take uh, conclude my speech, wishing today's program a grand success and handing it over to the next speakers. Thank you all and thank you all. Uh, thank you very much, sir, indeed for the keynote address and also for all the uh, speech that you have delivered for the betterment of the students community as a whole. I would like to uh, call upon uh, Sir Klan Tsuma, who will be delivering a speech on NSS, its history and its future programs. And uh, the time shall be 15 minutes. Now I shall call upon him. Can you hear me, please? <clears throat> Hello? Yes, we can hear you. Yeah. Thank you, Mr. Chairman. And good evening to our respective principal, my dear colleagues, and all the participants in this very special occasion. And my topics to, uh, tonight is the history and the objective of National Service Scheme. Before we trace back the history of the National Service Scheme, one thing I like to mention tonight is that all the newly admitted students of Government Sahaya College, Sheha, are automatically the volunteers of NSS. So this orientation course, orientation program is also meant for you know, fresh students. So the National Service Scheme had been incorporated in the year 1969, the birth centenary year of our father of the nation, Mahatma Gandhi. Ever since the independence, there has been a growing awareness of the desirability of involving students in national service. And the first Education Commission 1950 recommended the introduction of a national service by the students on a voluntary basis. And in April 1967, the Conference of State Education Ministers recommended that the university states, the student could be permitted to join the National Cadet Corps, which was already in existence on a voluntary basis. And an alternative to this could be offered to them in the form of a new program called the National Service Scheme. And in the conference of the vice chancellors of various universities in September 1967, welcomed the recommendation and established this national service scheme. Initially, it is only for the higher education, that means the university and the college, but now it was extended to the plus two level. And On 24th September 1969, the, during the Gandhi centenary year and during the fourth five-year plan, this 
National Service Scheme was established. And the motto of the National Service Scheme is not me, but you. And the goal of the NSS is education through community service and community service through education. And the overall objective of the NSS is the development of the student's personality through community services. So we have a symbol, and the symbol of the National Service Scheme is called the RAT, a wheel of connected sun temple at Orisha. And that symbol has been appeared in our beds. This is the national beds of and the beds of the NSS. And this is the symbol of the NSS. And the specific objective of the National Service Scheme is to kindle the students' social consciousness, to give them opportunities to work with and among people, and to develop awareness and knowledge of social realities, and to have a concern for the welfare of, for the welfare of the community, particularly of the weaker section, and to engage themselves in creative and constructive social work and to put their scholarship to practical use in mitigating at least some social problems and in promoting welfare. And also to gain skills in the exercise of democratic leadership. So NSS, all the students of government side college, as we have already mentioned, are automatically the volunteers of the NSS. From now on, you are all the volunteers of the NSS and the obligation of the NSS volunteers is to work for two continued years along with their students, putting in at least 120 hours service each, each year and participating in world special camping. And the pride of the NSS is the best as we have, uh, I had already shown. This is the NSS bed, and the pride of the NS, uh, NSS is our bed and uh, certificate, which will stand volunteers in good stead in future care. The pride of the NSS is the best as we have uh, already shown. And the there is also an uh, organizational structure, and NSS has been set up under the national level, under the Ministry of Human Resource Development, and in a state, uh, in a regional level, and also in a state level. At the state level, we have university advisory committee under the leadership of the state license officer, or uh, at present, the state license of the designation of the state license officer has been changed as the state nodal officer. And at the college level, we have a college advisory committee in which the principal of the institution is the chairman, the ex officio chairman of the advisory level. And the scheme is to look after by the joint secretary, assisted by the deputy secretary, under secretary, and other staff of the Ministry of Educational and Culture. And in our College, as we had mentioned, the principal is the ex officio chairman of the advisory committee. And apart from this, we have three program officers, namely, Vanu Tlanchunga is me, and Dr. Jeddi Lalmangizawa, and Pu Lalzomliana. And Let me highlight the uh, important duties of the student volunteers. As we had mentioned, all the students are the volunteers of the NSS. The first duties of the volunteer is to establish the board with the people in the project area. Secondly, 
identify the problem and resources of the community. And thirdly, plan programs and carry out the plans. And fourthly, relate the, his learning and experiences toward finding solutions to the problems identified. And lastly, record the activities in his work diary systematically, systematically and assess the progress periodically and effect changes as and when needed. And there are some code of conduct for NSS volunteers. Let me highlight the conduct of the NSS, code of conduct of the NSS volunteer. All volunteers shall work under the guidance of a group leader nominated by the program officers. And secondly, they shall make themselves worthy of the confidence and cooperation of the group community leadership. And thirdly, they shall scrupulously avoid entering into, the, into any controversial issues. And fourthly, they shall keep day-to-day -day record of their activities, experiences in the enclosed phases of the diary and submit to the group leader, program officers for periodic guidance. And fifthly, it is obligatory on the part of the on the part of every volunteer to wear the NSS badge well on work. So let me continue in Mizo. NSS are here government side college students on Zong Pehi automatically enroll in the uh Juan NSS activities umbre rena here and in the via in Kelsel, and I told on any. The Juan can sit up and can NSS motto to not me, but you. NSS. Yes. Okay, let, let me continue. And we have a number of targets in this year, in this academic year, 2021 to 22. And these targets should be procured. Firstly, we have in our college, we have number of uh, four units in number. And our, our first target is voluntary blood donation. And at least 80 units of blood should be targeted in this academic year. And secondly, tree plantation. At least 30 Chaplain should be planted during this academic year, and self-defense training should also be uh, conducted once. And there are a number of awareness campaigns to be uh, pursued. Firstly, rainwater harvesting and maintenance of reservoirs. And secondly, awareness campaign on Swartz Barat and river res rejuvenation. And fifthly, fire prevention trace and career guidance, tries women empowerment and gender inequality, ones organic farming, human trafficking and child protection, ones it's drugs abuse, HIV, AIDS, tobacco control, etc. Trace use of LED bulb and solar energy, ones orientation training program for volunteers ones. And apart from this target, we are proposed, uh, we're proposing three special camping. And in this year, Tierra Parang, they are uh, adopted village. And on, uh, on this village, three special camping should be organized during this uh, academic year. So there are uh, many things to say about the uh, activities and prospects of the NSS, but time is over for me. And thank you for 
giving me a chance to deliver my speech. Uh, back to Mr. J uh, Benjamin. Thank you. Thank you very much, uh, Sir Tonsuma, for deliver delivering a speech on the history and uh, the future programs of the NCC, uh, NSS. I'm sorry. Uh, and we are enlightened with uh, the programs and prospects of the NSS. And I would like all the students to uh, actively participate in this NSS programs. Uh, due to this COVID-19, we might not be able to participate actively uh, as of this now, but in the future, let's hope that the pandemic would uh, come to an end, hopefully, and let the answers, programs, and prospects would be uh, involved in the future. I hope and request that each student actually participate in this analysis. Thank you very much. I'd like to uh, call upon Sma Panorama to deliver a speech on choice-based credit system, uh, which is very important, which most of the students are not well acquainted with this choice-based credit system. And there are certain students who do not have the knowledge on how the credit grade marks have been given. And so they are facing a lot of problems in the, uh, after uh, releasing the uh, exams, I mean the uh, results. So he'll be talking on the choice-based credit system and also with uh, giving an enlightenment to the great system. Now I shall call upon Sir Mark. Sir Mark, please. Thank you very much, uh, Sir Benjamin, for hosting and uh, greetings to each one of you and uh, uh, respected uh, principal, uh, professor, professor uh, Abdul uh, Barbuya, Abdul Hanan Barbuya, and uh, Sir Tanchunga, Sir Thanga, uh, Sir Ben, and I think uh, there are other faculty members as well. Uh, and uh, all the students who are here joining on Zoom as well as on YouTube. I see that there are about 58 of you are on YouTube. So this is a great opportunity to come together and to learn something very important, something that will have a very important bearing for your upcoming uh, semesters and this particular semester as well. Now, before I launch into the things that we're going to learn from the uh, CBCS system, I also want to add that uh, there are no representatives tonight to talk about other clubs and other activities, other co-curricular activities that are very helpful for the students. So I just want to highlight some of those. You see, uh, dear students, in our college, we have a bubbling community of students that are uh, focusing on certain interests. First of all, I want to talk about Adventure Club. We have a thriving and very energetic Adventure Club also in our college. They do a lot of tours and expeditions, and they have... Many students have enlightened, have been enlightened, have practiced, and they have found their niche in that. So if uh, the coronavirus pandemic peters over, uh, we believe and we urge you to join uh, the Adventure Club. There is another club uh, uh, called the Rifle Club. I don't know how many of you are interested in shooting the rifle. But there we have here we have rifle club also for some of you who are interested in shooting and who want to make a career out of that i think you can inquire we also have i think uh, sir benjamin is heading a uh, legal literacy uh, uh, and i think we also have a red ribbon club uh, all these are a very uh, good club um, clubs um, and uh, and very importantly uh, we also have the Evangelical Union. In fact, uh, I am the advisor of the Evangelical Union. Evangelical Union will 
cater mm-hmm. to your spiritual needs. We have a thriving and very strong presence here. And we would mm-hmm. like all the first year students to join Evangelical Union. And I think these days they are doing some online uh, Bible mm-hmm. studies as well. So this will be for your moral growth, okay? So uh, there may be other clubs also and uh, under students' union activities, I think there will be many areas where you can develop your talents. So this college is going to be something very interesting as well, okay? Uh, Sir Ben, I'm hearing some buzzing sound. Can we mute everyone else or is it me alone? Okay. So now, can you hear me? Yes, sir. Yes, we can hear you. So, Ben? Yes, I can hear you. Hello? Yes, I can hear you very much. So uh, I think now I'm audible, right? Okay, so let's go over to now what we're going to uh, discuss. Um, See, the choice-based credit system is the system that has been introduced now at your stage. You know, the great shift is that earlier you uh, have, uh, you have uh, not really been given choices, but at least here, theoretically, Mizoram University has given us uh, a very radical shift uh, in which we, you are able to choose the subjects. Now, in big colleges and universities, this CBCS uh, choice-based credit system works very well, but in our college, or small college like us, uh, colleges like us, uh, we don't have many choices. And that's why uh, we cannot really discuss the, the kind of comb- kinds of combinations uh, that can come. So uh, I want to focus more on the calculation of the marks, which is very important. Even today, somebody asked me, your seniors, sir, I do not know how to calculate. I want to enroll. And so I kept getting occasionally all the time uh your seniors who do not know how to calculate their marks and it's quite shameful we have taught them very well but uh, it is not like a just calculating percentage anymore okay so that is why you have to look and listen to this uh lecture very very carefully i'll share the screen here So can you enable me to share the screen? So Ben, kindly enable me to share the screen. Okay. Go to security and you can just click on that enable screen sharing. Otherwise, I can't do that. Please, sir, please, sir, please guide me. All right. I think it's better you sir. make me a host. Yeah. Do you know how to make me a host? Just make me a host. Uh, I'll, I'll, I'll do that. I'll be easier. I made you as a co host. I, mean, I think I had already given you as a host. I'm not a host. Okay. Is it right now? Yes, sir? thank you very much. Now we can do that. So, uh, as of now, I'm going to mute everyone. Otherwise, uh, we hear a buzzing sound here. Some distractions. Okay. I think Chachunge is the, the culprit here. Okay. Chachunge, you have to mute yourself, okay? Oh, we're going to have to put her in the waiting room.
Okay, sorry for the time taken due to technical difficulty. So here we have uh, the choice-based system, choice-based credit system. Earlier, as I said, uh, in your uh, high school, higher secondary school, all your marks are calculated based on percentage, but not anymore. This time it's different. And uh, let's take a look at uh, this, you know, uh, something that we are going to get every semester at the end of every semester you're not going to get mark sheets okay no more mark sheet we call it uh, a transcript transcript basically the same thing so there is no mark sheet but this is called transcript all right so it is a score sheet of semesters all right one semester after another after another and finally it accumulates into uh, cgpa now, let's look at the first one, SGPA. SGPA is a score sheet of a semester. So at the end of every semester, you have six semesters. Uh, so you're going to get your, uh, mar uh, your transcript as well as your SGPA. Right. We'll tell you how to calculate your SGPA. Now, there are four courses in every semester, uh, including the, the first semester. Uh, each paper carries a total of 100 marks. So we have four papers and 25 marks plus 75 marks. And out of these, one is your foundation course, which you are studying now and you will be studying in the second semester. And the remaining three are your elective courses. Your elective courses are the courses from which you will choose your um, core paper later on. Okay. So now uh, each of these courses carries a credit. It is a very important concept called credit now, which is denoted by number either five or six. Either five or six. So I hope you get the whole point here. So we're going to get SGPA at the end of every semester. And you, you don't have a trans, you don't have a mark sheet, but you do have a uh, transcript in, in which you will have uh, your SG, SGPA written. And, uh, so these are the few basics that you need to know first. And now let's look at another basic that you need to know. Listen to this very carefully. And now marks to grade conversion. Your marks that you get out of 100, you're not going to get it like 89 or 70 or 60 or 50. That will not be used for calculation like that, just like it is. It has to be converted now. Now let, take a look at this. Uh, let's look at from the, the top here. If you get in one paper, remember every paper uh, has a uh, a hundred uh, hundred hundred marks as a, a total mark. So eighty nine point five. If you get eighty nine point five uh, to hundred marks, then your letter grade will be outstanding. So remember this: we have letter grade here. So somebody's got uh, like say 90, 95, 98. So all of you are outstanding according to this letter grade. And then you will have a grade value of 10. Remember, this is going to be very important for this conversion, okay? If you get in that particular paper, let's say 70, from 79.5 to 89.4, you'll get A plus, which your grade value will be nine. Well, likewise, Remember, the full mark is 100. So out of 100, if you get somewhere between 69 to 69.5 uh, to 79.4, you have grade value of 8. So all these. Now, if you get from 0 to 39.4, yeah, that's a grade for fail, and you, your grade value will be 0. Okay? So that's another concept that you need to know beforehand. Look at this very, very carefully. Okay? Now, next, let's go on. Now, in the first semester, in your first semester, look at this. You said there are four papers, right? This is uh, an example. You have FC. FC is common paper, which carries five credit. And you have EC1, you have EC2, you have EC3. These are your optional or elective papers. It could be economics, it could be MISO, it could be sociology, political science, history, you know, education. So these are the papers and they carry credit of six, okay, six credits, right? So 
in this uh, six minutes, uh, I mean, you in this uh, six credits, so you have this calculation to be done. Out of 100, total is 100. Now remember this. Let's take a look at some example. Now, look at this. Foundation course, the credit, all these will remain stationary because they carry with them their own credits. Now, letter grade is a great value. So that means, look at this, foundation course, the first one, some student, this is an example, by the way, one student has got, if that is an eight, so what? So somebody's got about 69, between 69.5 to 79.4, all right? So the, his marks is between this, and that's why we have grade value eight, all right? Now, like that, grade value B, grade value O, means uh, outstanding so we multiply the, with the grade value 10 okay now this is credit c is the credit and you have to multiply with that so the credit 5 into 8 now 6 is stationary so 6 into 7 because there is a great value that it receives all right take a look at this it's very simple now all together after this you add up whatever has been multiplied here. You got 178. And this is the total credit of that semester. That is 23. All right. So now FC here, here, here. So I think I've already explained that. So now you just divide by the total number of credit by the total number of uh, uh, I mean the, uh, things that we have already added up, the quantity. So it comes to 7.739. Okay. That is for one semester. We have six semesters, remember? So for every semester, you do it that way, all right? Every semester, you do it that way. And ultimately, you come at the end, you have CGPA, all right? So CGPA is the, the parameter that you're going to be judged by. Now, look at this. At first semester, credit, you have 23, and SGPA is this. Second semester, credit is 23. These are all examples. So third semester, the credit is this, and an example of a particular student. So at the end of the sixth semester, how do we calculate? 140 is the total credit of all the semesters, right? 140. So if you add up all these, you get 140, the numeral. So this, 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 right? So 140. And uh, therefore, this is first semester, second semester, third semester, fourth, fifth, sixth, divided by 140, okay? So 23 is the credit, and then this is the SGPA. Now 23 is a total credit again in the second semester, so this is your CGP, SGPA. So like that, this is in your third semester, in your fourth semester, in your fifth semester, in your sixth semester, and on, all right? So these are the things uh, that you have to do. And then finally you divide by 140 and that becomes your CGPA. This is the most important thing that you can present. And so somebody asks you, what's your CGPA? How much you got? Uh, uh, then you'll have to answer this using this number. This numeral is the most important number, okay, for you. Now, so that is how you calculate your uh, CGPA. So every semester you have SGPA, second semester, third, fourth, fifth, and finally you calculate from all the SGPAs with this, you know, like this. Uh, and that's how you get your CGPA. But there's a question. The question is, in some universities or if my parents or somebody wants to know my percent, how can I tell them the percentage of the marks that I get. All right, that's always a, a problem. So it's very easy how to convert this into percentage. Uh, look at this, by the way, this is a first division, second division, third division. If your CGPA is less than five, you fail. If your CGPA falls between five and 6.5, second class, between 6.5 to eight, your first class, eight to 10, uh, distinction. So the calculation uh, conversion of CGPA to percentage is very simple. You just multiply by 10. All right, so our six semester students, the hypothetical six semester student gets 69.93 percentage, All right? Just to multiply by 10 at the end of the six semesters, okay? 
So uh, those are the few things that uh, I would like to share with you at this point. Uh, later on, I think I will share with you this slide that I've given you at the FC class somewhere in future so that you would know exactly. It's very, very important that you know how to calculate your marks uh, right from now on. Uh, otherwise, you won't really know you'll be shocked and you won't really prepare yourself. It is very important. Uh, so uh, I think that way you can also organize yourself and look ahead for the future. Thank you. We'll give back uh, the host rights to uh, Sir Benjamin. So, I think he's gone. He's not here. Is he still here? Okay, I'll make him a host. Okay, sir, back to you. Okay, thank you, sir. Uh, <clears throat> thank you, sir, for the for enlightening us with the Joy Space Grid systems, uh, and this is really a very important uh, for all the entire students community. Uh, in knowing and acquainting themselves with the mark gradings. Thank you, sir, very much. Now I shall call upon uh, Sir Aram Tintana to deliver a speech on um, online mode of examination. And he will also enlighten us with uh, the important uh, notes in regard to online mode of examination. Sir, Aram Dittana, please. Sir, Aram Dittana, please. Is he still here? Might be his net, he had a network uh, issues. Sir Aram Tintana. Uh, hello, is my voice audible? Hello, is my voice audible? Am I... Am I audible to Sir Aram Tintana, please? Let's wait a few minutes. He might, he might have some network issues. So he will be returned back.
Sir Mark. Hello, Sir Mark. Hello, Sir Mark. And and it's so turn up this. Okay, Sir Mark, uh, I mean, Sir Ramtita, you can mute your, unmute yourself. You can, yes. Yes. Can you hear me? Yes, we can hear you. Go ahead, sir. Sorry, sir. Hello, Sir Ben, can you hear me? Yes, we can hear you. Yes, Sir Tama, you can go ahead. We can hear you. Okay. Okay, thank you, Sir Ben. I'm going to start. Good evening, my dear colleagues and respected principal and all the participants. Uh, for Yes, go ahead, sir. Oh, okay, sir. Get internet at Hello, that may a boy called me up. Me know that he may la and be yella and tap well villa a full lay tailor. The Jim's over and shed ten on a gay two exam to tang a car online exam to tang a เอ่อมีเจ้าตรงนี้เสียเดี๋ยวเล่นสวยกันตุ้มงาอืมลูกเดิ้วลงง่ายเท่าล่ะสกรีนเชียร์ริงค่ะกระดูเวียวน้ำ
còn lại những dòng chủng trang đều châu huy cần suy nghĩ um exam phim phim hi exam session hi zoom le zoom đi khata hi anh em first semester hi cần exam à oh odd semester tin event semester hi november à ngọc cần suy nghĩ rồi event semester le odd semester à ông à chú chú Old semester hit first sem, third sem le, fifth sem an niya. Ti chuan chu chu nevem baan ni so ma. Tu na mi first sem le, third sem le, fifth sem hau hi. Nevem baan ni so ma exam tu re niya. Chu chu old semester ti niya. Chu chu tu na first semester hau kha in lo khet ke dua. Ke ma po hi te ma ngay tu a chop deo le ka sui deo a ngay a. E u duk deo khan lo ngay thao la. Di tuan event semester hi Januari tengah tengah lelaki first sem hok ha in pas file. Event semester ha Jun ah Januari tengah hian in tengah lelaki di tuan Jun ni kata hian exam le tunggu ni. Tuan tu na first semester hok tuan in November ni so mah hian exam kan ni do na. Tuan amat sayin mak ha mak konten lah hi kan soi do na kan soi masa ha. Ma konten ini awain mak zaa niya full mak subjek katakan. Mak zaa niya tajuan twenty five ahi internal C A antia continuous assessment antia tu tu C A ni internal mak antia twenty five. Aku ma twenty five kah mani kolej setengah test kan ni test assignment test performance ni ta tajuan Adik tak a assignment mark tu eight marks ni a home assignment kan ti ka? Hemi home assignment hi inti lau juan mark riat in loss hal ti nanti twenty five akan. So when mark riat tak a home assignment kat ti ngi ngi tur ni a. Di juan mark som pat ni twelve mark a ka test ni a test siwa ini kan kontak si na first test le second test. In the same way, the 12th mark is 24 and the 12th mark is 24. The 12th mark is 24 and the 12th mark is 24. So, the home assignment is the test mark and the mark is the test mark. So, the test mark is the test mark. So, the test mark is the test mark. So, the test mark is the performance and the in-class attend. Atenden saka, kaka, mark nga po ni. Tutu, te sinpek lo yung mo, assign minin ti lau khan in lo zel, ti na niya, tutu ti ngay ngay to rin ni. Tuan, internal mark hi, CA hi, continuous assessment hi, in na ilaw tuan, exam thay lo yung sim, external 75 mark saka, ay exam thay lo ni. Ti tuan, Internal mark tu first test tu nak kena izau cia, tu an second test si kena nai le doh ni. Tu mi izau tu an November ni so mak hian external kena nai doh la seventy five mark. Tu tu kena hunkar masa akalin order on suaka tu order tu an kena mak putan tu raka. Section A and Section B are on the same thing. Marks on the same thing, Paper A and B are on the same thing. Paper A, Paper A, Section A and B are on the same thing. Section A is multiple choice question. MCQ on the same thing. MCQ on the same thing. Six questions from each unit. Unit is on the same thing. Subject is on the same thing. Subjek tinahan unit ngaco ama, cumi unit kata tuan question for MCQ lokal don ini. Tuan MCQ awain somtum thirty question arong kal dona. Tuan section B akan short answer niya. Short answer ha three marks ane dona pakatin. Twenty question ane niya four question from each unit niya. Kerja tiada minyak ringan. 
unity na koison pali thuk mak thum pu rong dal don ni chuan mcq paruk nen chuan ava in multiple choice koison ka som thum koison ro kalanga chuan 3 marks ka ava in 45 marks total to 75 marks din ni don ni chu chu ni na kan exam dan tur em ba ni soma online na kan exam dan tur ni so online mo ta kan exam don so ni question kha university tang mi ron phone nga chu chu e prepare ta ha chuat ne lok ta ne chu chu ron phone nga ke ni ton kha a sofi ton don don ni a sofi pd filing kan ron tho e open book in in sang don ni open book ti chuan open book in sang anga in chang sa kha hmm tha in langa in khala ka kha ansar phone natur phone number emo kan ron danga whatsapp number emo kan ron danga ta khan in ron thon don ni chu chu ke ni kan lo print le anga kan lo print anga chu kan print a chu safe custody a kan da to ang chu chu kan ti dan tur ania hmm chu wang in exam la ya khan hmm instruction hi tun ba ka kai thai lo mo ni mai thai a chu wang chun chu chu akal phum tur tun ami ta chuan a zual pui kan sia tur te uni ta se mo thian in covid na nu ya apang ai ang voi khat ma kan exam to lowa e system phang phang kan exam thri na chu wang chon tu na mi online mo karon se kha tu na kan exam dan tur chu ania hm kha kha thu le o mani chon ti dang lam thai ni nga chon first semester ho khan se tur chu semester exam paper exam semester sim sim hi exam subject li in nei tam pui ta in nei ve ka subject li han subject khatal in aten lo chon next semester kal thai lo ti kha in lo se don ya next semester kal tu chon exam kha e paper pa khatal kha atte mangai ni chu 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 ti lo chon next semester kal thai lo wa chu chu kan thale nga ti chon enton and fair means sakha a omem ti kha zona omai the ya online mode ani awang in om lo wang ti kha ngai dan in lo nei ni mei thia ama ro chu enton hi alo oma ni kuma last exam apo kan problem kan ne a chu chu inin copy mo ani chuan in kha kha enton ani anga tin photo atha in la atha in lak pdf atha in lak kha in chente je sai mo thai lo la palani chuan in lo la ni chuan examiner stand paper check to examiner kha ni enton kha lo detect ta thine ni chu wang chuan enton kha a om thaiya Nang mani nghe ni cha nang ai ni ni chuyen te ta copy mo tha lau lak sa ke mo ka a thiang lau ni chu chu examiner kan a lau detect mai je la ka ka har san ning to lau nan in film ku nan kan sui lok dua ti chuan a tha lak da na ka i experience nei lau tam ta ki no ma nga six semester theng po hien tu na fifth semester te po in la thiam vak lau no ma chu chu tha in la khan pdf kha kam scanner mo thatak in manganga chuan paper size che tha in lang paper chi kha athen chu ni kuma kan exam experience a khan in an ke te an kut te an bet sit te an do kan te kha lo lang tel thina chu chu mu nuom lo ni mai lo in kan prina khan khang ho kha lo tel ta thina a lo tel ta chuan an sar paper kha ter te kha lo ni to ni chuti ni chon in examiner tan check la ka om ta lowa ke exam rang sia ka fail ti mo ke exam rang sia ka wat ti chebe ti kha om theya chu wang chon thala a kha ni apoi mo khop me pdf tha in la khan chu chu film khur takin tha in la khan e scan na remo in phone apo hana thena chon thatak tak oma document thala na big te kha oma kha kha uluk de in in lo la don ya ti kha kan sei dua ti chon ni 
in paper submit the tour phone number ka kan ron da anga ta chon in ron thon bok don ani chu chu in lo se lok don ya ti chon in expel chung cha nga ha sui le nga ya kole sa hin in no chua te om them in sem no om them ti kha zon om mai thea kole sa ni wang hin om lo lo ni mi lo wa expel kha om thea kan kole sa ngai po hian mi pakha chu kan expel to a kan no chuak to a chu mi kan no chua chana chu chan thang thang om thea zir ti tu te thu oi lo wang e mo kole in a rules and regulation kan ne a chung zom lo te chu no chua thai expel the ni a ne zir ti tu za lo nai mo khatiang in lan ti ra mo ani chuan expel kha in tok thea tin exam chung changa po sensitive va vin expel kha all le zo le ni chu chu expel ani chuan mizoram college strong strong university noya affiliated college noya mi a khan khoya ma in kal thei tolawang chu wang chuan e film khuranga ni ti kha in sheta tan kan sui le duwa ti chuan exam chung chang bi khrim sima kha online mo ta nia chu chu open book ni Open book in exam dona ka ka in the don ya. The chuan in fee fee structure he form fill up chung chang he an sui le lok an dua hmm form fill up pun he nang ni he regular how he odd semester how he hmm October first week a form fill up anga. ta chuan form fill up na document poi mo te chu last mark sheet and the class 12 a in mark sheet a kha entinan tha semester tan chuan second semester a a mark sheet a kha tinani chu chuan nang ni first semester tan bi chuan class 12 mark sheet xerox khania nga chuan registration card kha ngai boka tin aadhar card nga ya passport size pa passport ji chungai lo turangai la notification kan ron chhole thau do na chunga chon passport thala ka kha chu online ani wa in angai chi lo turangai la chu chu in lo in lock thai nan october first week a hian form kan fill up do na ni ti chon fee structure kha kan sil fee le lok chunga fee structure kha regular ta khan exam fee sim sima hi cheng janga le somnga ania athen chon lo chin chia ta ola exam fee hi cheng janga le somnga ania chon janga somnga khan paper pali in nei ta khang hau kha tela ni chumi ba pila ma chon mark sheet fee hi cheng san hi som ania admit card hi cheng za ania chon center fee hi zali te kan la a ta janga te Amaro chu kumina hin kan la fixia lo wa zanga vel tal chu ngay karing online na ni chuan in answer paper ha kan print vek ka kan print vek ka wang han po isa ka ahek si na chu wang chuan at lo at liem vak thay lo ni di chuan a four man shim shim hin cheng som hi te kan la ve bo ka di chuan every sin sang ha za thum som ruke mo sang ha za li sang ha zanga vel bo na ni Kuk ni reng Kau tak kecium lewa, tapi tu kalau hari ber, di koran tu kan, kan bicara ni lewa bicara kat sini kan, bicara tu, lu bicara tu, lu bicara tu, bicara tu. Ia 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 tu. So, when you have registration, you have a form to fill up the exam form to fill up the registration card. You have to go to the migration. You have to go to the registration. You have to go to the registration. You have to go to the registration. You have to go to the repeater. Zanin ayin first semester lo repeater stepo ka an lo omve thau in kasiya repeater stand bikan kun kamangra ido may thimin lo rithim nok la 
repeater start be khan subject khata form fill up na man kha change a som nga ni a mark sheet fee kha change an hi som admit card kha change a center fee change a a form man change som hi zanga som ret anga ni ama ro ju pai parti na change a som ngai na pung zel ni ti kha e lo se bok se la ti chuan in thil pakhat le lok repeaters le all comer ho tang khan e consolidate mark sheet chung cha kha zona tam lu tu ka consolidate mark sheet chung cha kha kan soinga tin tu na first semester po khan in lo thiat lo ka tan a pui mo lu tu ka kha e consolidate mark sheet hi fail mi lo first semester na six sem thena pass suak tan chuan boi pui ngai lo wa mark sheet le certificate khan nei thei me a ama ro chu first semester na six sem thena Six semester exam to si tha semen mo back paper nei khatiang ho back nei awa nga chuok nga lo ho ka consolidate mark si ta lo ngai ta consolidate mark si ta nga awa nga six semester a in mark si original a ka kami le in back na paper tha semester entira tha sem lo ni ta se tha semen mi mark si ta ka 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 in telang ka ka na zero copy ka in keng telanga ti chuan e six semester mi kha chu original in keng thunga chu chu e mz iwa mizoram university examination book a kon e ati tu ten oma ta kon a form oma a form an pe chuang chu in fill up anga ta chuan mani mi malin in boi pui ngai ve to ni college in kha kha chu consolidate mark sheet ngai kha chu kan boi pui thailo ni ti kha in lo se bok don ni Nah, di tahun exam cungcang ah, siang tok view tahun kerja, hmm, tu nak kan exam tu lah, November ni semua, ane rutin tu lah cuak lewa, rutin orang cuak vele, rutin ah exam ni sun boting kan, siang leh ah, tu tu kan modified leh dong ni, kah kah inlo enang ah, tin ni हर सत्ता इन नहीं चुन जोरें थे करने दिखा कं सही दो बोका मार अच्छा थिल टूल लो थिल होते ते खचु इंजोट लोई लग का दुआ जोने ही तमलु तुक चुन इनका इंचांग सेंग चिन लो ने लेकिन एग्जाम ते पॉइंट नोट मत संदो ना चुन अच्छा इनफॉरमेशन छत्तक कर रहे हैं पेंगा ताचुन लो बुए लो तुरन्या ची Inzo ka atul lem lo kan dia kan experience sedang cucu student hau tekan lo siap sapula kan dulu ni ni zaini nak kan vice chair menzo ka ka saat top semua kan PC kan dia maru suki ma hamin titi lah kasi fuvak lo mai dia tamtak ka ka maru suki ka ayak clear ka cun tun cuma tan cun sui har Dewa, tongkam kat siam vak lewa kat di zona ka exam tu nang a, kalau pek teh tu ni sila, siat siam lewi ni ni cuan min zat don ya, lekalo me. Okay, Sir Aram Tintang, thank you very much for the and for enlightening us with the. Um, examination procedure. Uh, we want to be a hearty uh, gratitude to you. Now uh, we shall wind up with the Zoom and YouTube online video conferencing. Uh, we, we, I heartily, on behalf of the Government Science College, can be my hearty gratitude to all the speakers, sir. Uh, Abdul Hanan Barbuya, uh, esteemed principal, and also to Sir Tansuga, our senior associate professor, Carmen Sire College, and Sir Mark B. Vanujama, assistant professor, English department, and Sir R. Ramkintana, uh, sociology head of department. Thank you all.
now we shall end up with this uh, program. Thank you all. May God be with you. Good night. Good night, sir.